Welcome to Voice Bootcamp, a global name in unified communication. In this lecture, we will discuss Cisco licensing. Cisco licensing is one of the most difficult and complex topics for one to understand, and there is no particular training unless you are a Cisco partner. Although CCNP level, Cisco uh, licensing is not a major topic of the CCNP candidate. However, for a job market, it could be very useful, especially when you're going to be interviewed by companies and they're looking for someone with knowledge about licensing. Well, even if you don't require the job, an additional skills will definitely uh, help you stand out in an interview process. And of course, understanding Cisco licensing will help you choose the right uh, devices and uh, licensing method that are available to unified communication. The main reason for us to provide Cisco licensing lecture on DVD as part of CCNP Voice is a uh, to help candidate like you to understand the complexity of Cisco licensing that exists and make it a smoother for you, a smooth transition for you to understand and learn this uh, this topic. Second is to provide our CCNP Voice candidate a, a value-added service for this package because, again, we always claim to be unique in terms of providing uh, uh, such package in CCNP Voice level. We were the first one to introduce CCNP Voice uh, with the current model of presence and unity connection back in 2008 when Cisco just recently updated their module. So we were ahead of Cisco to by two years almost. Understanding Cisco Unified workspace, workspace License and User Connect License and then Unified Communication Software Subscription. So these are the three things we'll be focusing on. Cisco licensing structure can come in two models. A la carte model, which is known as User Connect License, license based on per user, and application bundle Cisco Workspaces license where it comes in a bundle or group of users. Workspace license is basically has many functions uh, that allows you to use all the application that uh, or most of the application that uh, that are available in unified communication. It is divided into business edition, entry level, standard, and pro version of Workspaces license, and each license provide uh, different level of application privilege. For example, if you are going to get a business edition uh, Workspaces license you will have the privilege to use all these applications right here along with your uh, you know call control and of course endpoint user user license uh, phone license if you have the entry level license you can only use well you can use your phone control that means that the basic functionality of the phone you will be allowed to add well you have you will have one license for an IP endpoint and and one for your PC 